So we all know we're supposed to bring water to the disc golf course, but I'm going to list five essential things that every disc golfer should have in their bag. Now the first one is bug spray. Bug spray is really going to help on the course, especially if it's a wooded course and it rained a couple days ago, there's going to be a lot of bugs out because we all know about that one time when you're about to throw your disc into the basket and you hear something buzzing in your ear and then you mess up a little bit and it doesn't go in. Now the second thing, which I think is super important, is a disc golf towel. Now it doesn't have to be a disc golf towel, I just like to get the microfiber towels because they're usually small and pretty thin and they get all the water off the disc. But having a towel in your disc golf bag is super helpful, especially when it's raining and you're about to throw a drive. You probably want to like wipe your disc off under an umbrella or something so you have a good grip and then just go for the one throw. But if you don't have that, you're going to be struggling the whole round. Now this next item really helps me, but I know for a lot of people they're not really going to like it that much and it's medical tape and basically what it is is it's a really thin uh, small kind of tape thing that you just wrap around your finger and what I would used to do is I would always wrap it around my finger right here because when I would throw the disc my nail would kind of like get torn off and one at one time I basically had a third of my nail missing this middle finger because I would throw a sidearm like this and I throw kind of like this and I don't know that's just changed it for me but the medical tape really helps with the grip you get a really nice grip every single time and even if you have sweaty hands that one spot is always gonna be super dry and like super consistent now the fourth item is really helpful I think for everyone unless you're super gifted and you'll have sweaty hands at all you should probably pick up a birdie bag as it dries out your hands immediately for the shot and it really helps with the grip and if you don't live by a disc golf store, there's always an alternative. If you can get your hands on this white gravel stuff in the picture here, this stuff works better than the birdie bag. And honestly, the only downside is it gets pretty messy, of course, but I think next time I play this course, which is Hudson Mills, if you couldn't tell, um, I'll probably get a bag of it for myself because that stuff is Right, I don't see it anywhere else. I've never seen it anywhere else except Hudson Mills. But be careful because there might be like glass or something in there, so you never know. So it would be best to go to like a hardware store or something to see if you can buy it for yourself that way. Okay, now the last item you should have in your disc golf bag, personally, I think it's a good idea, is just have five bucks on you because it's not that much money. And the reason I say that is because when you play disc golf in your area a lot, you're gonna recognize some of the same faces and stuff. And you know, it's kind of fun to get like a game going, maybe like uh, doubles and there's two teams and you're playing against another team, everyone puts in $5, it makes it more fun. You don't have to play for money, it can be $1, $2, whatever, but I think just having $5 in your bag is always helpful, especially like uh, if you're going to a new park and you don't have the pass and you forget there's always like $5 in your bag just sitting there. And you know, you could always like try to build it up to like $20 or something like that, just have like a goal in mind. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to leave a like if you agree with any of these items. And don't forget to subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next one.